a 2-1 to Bournemouth against Villa here with Andy Jennings. Andy, how are you feeling? Uh, I'm a little bit surprised, to be honest with you, Sam. My biggest fear all week was that Lemo would get booked early on for a foul on Grealish, and then Grealish would run the show by doing what he's so good at, getting in between the lines, finding space, and he would just pick us apart. Part of that came true, but happily, <laughs> happily yeah, only the first part. After that, um, we played... We played probably as defensively sound a performance as I've seen us put in this season and I think big credit to two of the most maligned players in the squad Simon Francis and Philip Billing who I think both had their, their best games of the season yeah. Francis I, I thought in the, the 90th minute they actually I haven't really noticed him today which is which is that, as big a compliment a good as thing, we can come it? to yeah. Yeah. Him, him and Billing I thought were immense today and when players that we've we've all criticised that we've all seen comments on Twitter comments online about step up like that I think it's brilliant and the uh, the atmosphere with the squad and all the, all the staff on the pitch at the end there fantastic to see there's a real it feels like the togetherness is still there and that's all we can really ask for. How does your view of this fixture change after that midweek match that they had against Leicester and then won it getting into the league? It's Cup an run? odd one because I've chatted about it with a few of my mates and thought, yeah, they're going to be on a real high, they're going to come down here and think we can beat these. And then another part of me says, well, sometimes when you get that real high, mm. you are on a come down at the weekend and maybe there, there was a little bit in their legs that we didn't have because we'd rested a few players on Monday night mm. against Arsenal. And maybe that showed a little bit, but to be quite honest, other than Grealish, there's very, very little quality mm. in that Aston Villa squad. And man for man, we're probably the better squad. But do you think also for the Bournemouth players who are maybe sitting down, you're watching that on Sky Sports on Tuesday night, you maybe thought, you know, we'll be all right on Saturday, you know, after that result, which, you know, Leicester, no mean feat. Um, maybe they thought, OK, we've got a game on here, we need to perform. Absolutely, absolutely. And hopefully the guys did sit down and think, yeah, these, these, this is a squad of players who, limited as they are, have got gone out there and got into a cup final, beating better teams along the way. Um, we're going to have to be on our game on Saturday. And I believe they were. They were all right up for it. Great to see. Feeling confident, positive, optimistic ahead of Sheffield United? Well, I'm not going to Sheffield United. It'll only be the second game I've missed all season. But... Um, <laughs> It'll be. Uh, I think I'll settle for a nice little dull nil nil or one all there. Yeah. And then I'll be back for Birmingham in a couple of weeks time. So yeah. fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Indeed. Fingers crossed. We'll get some and I believe content. Lerma's only banned for one match now, not two. Cause yeah. Because of, the, of the, uh, the second yellow. So we'll see how we get on. Last one. All, all right. right. Cheers, Annie. Thanks very much. Cheers. Oh. Okay.